Hello everyone, my name is Kang Sheng and I'm applying for the lectureship in polymers and composites. Here I would like to explain my key engineering concept of the lectureship and show you what I can bring to the university as a lecturer. Uh, this lectureship can be taken as a piece of engineering work um, supported by three very important pillars as shown on the screen, um, research, funding and teaching. Research is closely, closely related to RAF, uh, straight to the point, RAF 2021. I will at least bring four four-star assessments uh, for 2021 uh, using my expertise in the area. Um, over the last uh, two years, I've published a few papers in uh, world-leading journals, for instance, Macromolecules, um, Impact Factor of 5, um, and uh, I've just submitted one to Carbon, Impact Factor of 6, and uh, I'm preparing another two. According to the criteria for RAF 2014, my research can be classified as world-leading. Um, combining my expertise with uh, teamwork and uh, fantastic facilities we have in the College of Engineering, we will make it. Here I would like to give you an example of, uh, um, um, uh, of my research that can be used for RAF. Uh, reinforcement of uh, polymer thermal conductivities in the presence of graphene with and without chain orientation. Thermal dissipation is uh, critical to the performance, lifetime and uh, uh, reliabilities for electronic devices. However, many polymers, they have very low thermal conductivities due to the lacking of uh, freely moving valence electrons. Um, and this limits the polymer's applications in this field. There are many, many questions that stay unknown in this field. For instance, the influence of uh, chain orientation and the presence of nanophila on the polymer's thermal conductivities are vague. Graphene having large amount of uh, freely moving electrons could, rev could revolutionize the thermoconductivities of polymers. The size of the filler, the orientation, distribution, percolation threshold, polymer chain orientations will be studied to answer these questions. The fantastic facilities we have in the college can help us to carry out the research for instance, XRD and Raman can be used to um, characterize uh, graphene properties. Um, uh, Trans extruder can be used to mix the polymer with the graphene. Um, electron microscope uh, can be used to um, monitor the dispersion of the filler. And uh, tensile tester and deconditioned ovens can be used to stretch the samples to a certain degree and uh, recover at different uh, conditions. And thermal conductivities can be measured in the uh, polymer lab in, in the college. Um, and this is a rough picture of this research and I'm very looking forward to it. And the next pillar, funding. I'm currently supported by the University, the University of Leeds to apply for EPSRC fellowship and this can be transferred to a different university. And due to the uncertainties of Horizon 2020, um, I've started collaborating with people who I co-authored publications with uh, in China and Europe to apply for international uh, funding. Um, industry is another very important uh, funding resource that I have experience in and I will also work on it. And uh, teaching, I love teaching. Uh, I'm having a panel date in March for my UKPFS teaching fellow accredited by HEA. I'm now lecturing MSc modules in University of Leeds and I have developed um, my own methodologies for students to learn and uh, learn at high efficiency. I'm also happy to take some uh, responsibilities for academic leadership, for instance, make and uh, lead some new modules. And I can also, also contribute to national um, student service and uh, uh, survey and teaching ex excellence framework. My expertise in these three pillars can help me to construct the concept of a lectureship and my motivation and enthusiasm on the position will motivate me to develop the concept. I am ready for this job and I will be good at it. Um, thank you very much for your time and uh, hope to see you soon. Thank you. Bye.